Hey guys, if you're here, you're probably wondering, how can I get more people to see my Instagram stories and therefore get more people to follow me? Well, today I'm actually going to go over three most important things to do that so you can do that. So I'm going to go upstairs to my computer, uh, computer and I'm going to tell you everything. So guys, thank you much, so much for joining in, to be honest. And yeah, let's, without any further ado, let's get straight into the video. So... Three steps to get more Instagram story views in just 10 minutes. I'm gonna take my phone for this one. The basic thing is there are just a couple of things you need to remember with Instagram stories. Remember, you can share them. And if somebody shares your Instagram story, that's a, that's a huge ass advantage. I remember like a month or two ago, I was getting just 1000 views per story. And then I created a video, which was... It was like super fucking funny and relatable to, to a lot of people and I noticed my Instagram story views skyrocketed up skyrocketed up to 2000 views for just one day and it was because of the first thing we're going to go into right now in the slides uh, create appealing content um what do I mean by this? This content should be relatable, funny and stuff like that. Something somebody would share, right? You know those there's probably somebody in your country that has made like a music video uh, which was like super funny and then it just blew the fuck up. Um, it's because when somebody shares your content, uh, the algorithm just fucking loves it. It's like, ah, it's like, you know, imagine you waking up and then somebody goes over to you and hands you a million dollars. That's how great the algorithm is feeling if people share your content. A thing I used to do back in the day, which actually got me um, from 600 to 800 Instagram story viewers, it basically, it basically grew my Instagram page, uh, was creating edited content. And as you can see, uh, it's like a 15 second vine, you know? And why is this important? Because sometimes, if your stories are interesting, they're gonna appear, appear in the Explore feed. And if somebody clicks on it, they see the story, they enjoy it, they might follow you. And if you get exposed to those people on the explore page, that will be just fucking awesome for you. You can grow, like, even if only 200 people from the explore page see it, they might follow you. So that one story, which could be could go out to just 200 people, might get you 200 followers. With this, um, I, rec I recommend you doing some comedy. Uh, as I said, I did some edited videos too. Um, it kind of takes some time, but it's just 15 seconds, so that's super quick. Like some sketches, some, you know, like hashtag relatable stuff on there. Okay, so then number two, add hashtags. Um, not a lot of people do this. And one of my friends, uh, he actually made a video on this uh, uh, like a couple of months ago. And we were in a call. And I was like struggling, oh shit, like my Instagram page is not growing. Like, you know, you go into those phases where your page is not growing. And he told me like, do you put hashtags on your story? And I'm like, why the fuck would I do that? It just take some some space on the story. And he's like, you're a fucking idiot, Rainus. You po post a shit ton of hashtags and then you pinch them down. You pinch them down so fucking... To, to, to them being so small, you can't even see them. You can't even see them. What it's gonna do, it's gonna post your uh, story on the hashtags. You know, when you go to hashtags, there up there, there's some story, hashtag story. And when you click on it, you see all the stories in the hashtag. So basically, if you put it in a really like popular hashtag, people are gonna see it. And if only just 20 people see it, see it there's a possibility that one of them might follow you. And, you know, you might think, oh, just one follower, but think about it. If you post five stories a day, five stories a day, five new followers a day, and over the week, it's like 35 new followers. So it just compounds over time. For, for a lot of hashtags, um, if you get some good hashtags, you might, I have gotten up to like, uh, the, the highest I had gotten was uh, 30 followers from, from just one story because I put it on the best hashtags for fitness and it was like a fucking super great story. It was actually uh, edited. So uh, when people see more high, like higher quality content, they're gonna be you know gonna see that as more appealing. And yeah, that's that's a thing you can uh, add into your add into your Instagram life because that's gonna help you grow. Like I'm telling you, I swear. Okay, so the third thing, which is gonna be last, 
is post daily. Um, this is kind of a basic one. Uh, I would recommend you posting from 3 to 5 stories a day. Don't be that fucking guy who posts like 17 stories a day and you know what happens then? People just do this. They just swipe away from your shit. They don't give a fuck about what you say. And a lot of people I see, they're, they're like, they talk about a certain topic. Um, maybe that can be good, but, you know, from my experience, when I'm watching Instagram stories, I don't want to, like, you know, blast the fucking loud a audio out when I'm in pu public, except when I have my, you know, my headphones with me. And I don't have them with me for, like, for 24-7. So, that might be a minus uh, in terms of, uh, um, you know, posting kind of log type stories you just have to look at what your followers like like you can ask your followers what do you want to see in my story it's a super simple thing you can just ask your followers and this is a big mistake i see a lot of people do doing even with bigger channels they don't ask for you know for they don't ask their followers what did they want to see like uh with my mailing list i always at the end of the email i ask them what do you want me to write about like, what do you want me to write about? And then somebody, I just need one person to hit me out, out of like 300 people that are on my mailing list, because that one is like pretty exclusive, it's closed. And that one person, out of 300 of my like best fans, will hit me up with a question and I'll make an email about it for next week. Like, yo, that's just so fucking amazing, right? You don't even have to think about content. Your followers give you content, like, for free. And yeah, that, that's super awesome. You should utilize that. So yeah, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to learn how to grow your page, how to get more likes, how to make money online, how to make $240 a day passively, click on this card up here. I mean up here, I'm sorry. I always fuck up the sides. Uh, but click on the card up here and watch that video. And also, guys, feel free to subscribe if you want to learn more about personal brand branding and social media. Um, whew, I am tired as fuck. I'm gonna go outside ice skating because it's the weather is fucking beautiful outside. So guys, thank you for watching and peace.